Hello, this is the team from 5 Star Motorbike Rental in Kowlock and we are now going to explain the electronic key, also called, Smart Key. You start the Honda using a two-part keyless system, the electronic key and the receiver button. The two buttons on the Smart Key have three functions. The upper part shows a motorcycle and a horn. This allows you to find your motorcycle from a long distance and activate the alarm system from a short distance. The lower part showing a key is a key breaker which is explained at the end of this video. So if you see a lot of scooters, just press the top button to find your scooter. The scooter responds with a friendly beep and the blinkers. When you are within 5 meters of the machine, the transmitter and receiver will make contact and the large rotary knob on the bottom right of the scooter can be pressed to unlock, with a key symbol appearing on the speedometer. The alarm system can be deactivated by pressing the large rotary knob. Then press the rotary knob again and turn it clockwise until the digital display appears and the low beams turn on automatically. This is point one of the start procedure. Then the usual three other points of the starting process follow. Second, fold in the side stand. Third, pull the left brake. Fourth, press the start button on the right handle. From the actively displaying speedometer, a single click to the left takes you to the position for opening the helmet compartment under the seat with the fuel tank. Then press the bottom right toggle switch labeled Seat. Larger models also have the inscription Fuel on the top of the toggle switch and an external tank cap. Note, the key icon will automatically close after approximately 30 seconds. Then you have to press the big knob again and the symbol appears again. All other functions are the same as on other motorcycles. Turn signals left and right and reset to neutral by pressing the turn signal from above. The left brake is the rear brake, the right one is the front brake. It is a combination brake. Please pull both brakes at the same time to achieve the greatest possible braking effect. When it rains, you use the front brake almost exclusively with ABS models. The toggle switch at left thumb height is the high beam with a blue indicator light on the digital panel. The toggle switch for the automatic start-stop is at the level of the right thumb. The top position AH-OFF means it is disabled. If you switch on the automatic, the engine stops the next time you stop and you then start it again by accelerating. The bottom button on the smart key locks and unlocks the entire signal key system. If you press the button for 2 to 3 seconds until the diode light on the smart key turns red, the large rotary knob will be locked. To unlock, press the same button again for 4 seconds until the diode light turns red and then green. If no key symbol appears during the startup process, this means that the bottom button of the smart key must be pressed for about 4 seconds until a green LED lights up. Then the key symbol appears again by pressing the large rotary knob and the rotary knob can be moved again by pressing it in. The smart key can usually be kept in the right trouser pocket, you do not press it to start. Never put the smart key in the helmet compartment and always lock models with keys with a steering wheel locked at night to save the battery, because otherwise the key parts will look for each other and overnight the battery could be discharged, even if the low beam is switched off.